Reef Teats is sponsored by Brightwell Aquatics and Bulk Reef Supply. Today we're checking out shoreline corals. What's going on guys, Deb Freakies, and we're here with Corey at Shoreline Corals. How are you doing? Good, good, glad to have you. Awesome, thanks for having me. So grand opening day for a brand new store. Yes. How's everything going? So far it's been really good. We've yep. had a ton of good customers. Um, super happy, it's been yep. a long overdue thing after yep. COVID. Um, but like I said, we've uh, put a lot of time and effort into getting some good stuff for all the guys. Yep. And uh, yeah, so far everything's been awesome growing healthy and all the fish are looking good. So yep. we're happy. Awesome. Now you have a huge space in here. Like this is a pretty awesome size yeah. store. So I'm pretty soaked for you. It's like a, it a massive upgrade, which is awesome. It is. I kind of, I kind of say I wanted it to look a little bit like what I think is an Apple store. Yeah. So the Apple got, of corals. we got all these custom tanks built, yep. um, really sleek. Yeah. It looks really good. Yeah. They're all matched. Nice little sleek yes. lines. Took a lot of time to get that all all nice and straight, but yep. uh, yeah, <laughs> it's well well worth it. Yeah. So you guys also have you have some fire coral in here. You guys got a lot of nice. We stuff do. Going on. Yeah. You want you want to take a little walk and have a look yeah, at some of the look. stuff we got. Most most of the stuff we we bring in from you know Indonesia, um, Australia, stuff like that. Yeah. So what we wanted to do was we wanted to kind of bring a variety of corals, high end, you know, easier stuff as well, but just yeah. stuff that a lot of the people around don't necessarily get. Mm -hmm. um, and I think, I feel pretty confident we've done a pretty good job oh, dude, doing that this. so far. Even like that hammer, just yeah. a rainbow in there is beautiful. Yeah. This is actually my favorite tank. Yeah. Um, I, I, I'm oddly really digging this rainbows of hammer for whatever reason. It just looks so cool as it transitions yeah. one to the next. You know what? And it, one of the other things I love is I'm a big mushroom guy. So we got yeah. some pretty unique mushrooms down in the end tank that I'm like, I'm pretty stoked. I know which ones got, you're talking yeah, about. I'm, I'm pretty stoked to get those ones in. <laughs> yeah. No, love it. Okay, so you got all these beautiful tanks. What are you doing for filtering it all? So we have a filtration system set up in the back. One of the things when I say I like a clean setup, you go to a lot of these people's houses in the hobby and it's, you know, there's stuff everywhere. So I wanted to keep everything just tank, corals. Yeah. You know, Ben and I have done a little bit of research as far as like, yeah. you know, what other guys are doing. And we wanted to make sure that, you know, when customers are in here, all they're focusing on is, is the, the corals coral. and the fish in the tank. Yes. So we go into the back, we have yeah. kind of all of our filtration stuff back here. It's you. It's usually a little bit cleaner than this, but we've got the opening days, yeah. so we got a bunch of stuff here, but, so we have one system here running off, uh, you know, all the live rock. Yep. This is gonna be the coral tank. Then we have, uh, you know, our fish system set up here. So nice. this one we have running copper. Yep. Obviously we don't mix the two systems. RODI system in the back over there. Beauty. The black bin is where we mix all of our salt. Yep. And then, you know, this fish system we have just set up for the, uh, for the fish tanks. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. It's, it's nice and clean. There's the tanks, there's nothing there. It's all yeah. to get in. Super easy to maintain, tons of rock, everything for filtration. Yeah, and the one thing we wanted to try and do is we have everything set up on switches. So yep. over in the corner, if you want, you know, the flow set up mm -hmm. or you want, uh, if you want the return pumps turned off so customers can yep. make it stuff. Click of a button. Nice. Nice yeah. and easy. Got the air conditioning in here to keep everything yep. temperature controlled. This is kind of our fragging station we have yep. over here. Beauty. Everything to clean up. And then over in the back over here, this will be where we have, this system will be set up where we have our low light corals. Yep. Um, and then all of our live rock stuff is gonna be set up here once we eventually get everything set up. Nice. And yeah, we'll be rocking. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. Definitely a pretty sweet setup. Yeah. So if people want to, if they can't make it down here today, if people want to check it out, get corals you sell online or? Absolutely. Yep. So uh, right now the website's kind of, you know, up and coming, getting a little bit better. Most of our stuff is on there, but uh, selling corals, we're shipping Canada wide right now. So if you can't make it into the store, either reach out to us on Instagram, hit us up on the website and you know. Awesome. We'll help them out. Yeti, thanks yeah. so much for the tour. Awesome. Thank you for awesome. having coming. Thanks. Guys, just got back from a long drive, and of course, being at a grand opening, you have to pick up some goodies for yourself. So I'm gonna get this stuff dipped and acclimated to put in the tank, and I'll give you guys an update tomorrow. On the fish side, I actually picked up this really cool yellow line snapper, and my brother-in-law picked this out, so shout out and thank you, buddy. Um, under the white lights, it looked cool, but when you put it under the blues, it was absolutely amazing of how much it popped. Like those yellow lines look like they're fluorescent, like super cool fish. 
Next up we have one of my favorites, Milliporas. No idea which specific name it is, don't really care, but I just love those shaggy polyps that Millies have. Um, so I actually got two different Millies, so super stoked for both of them. And I also got a couple new hammers for the collection. We got this one that's more of a goldy, like bit of a rainbow goldy one that gets kind of like a greeny to golds. And the other one's an orange hammer, which is super cool. Hey, we got this new Favia, so super, super duper bright green. Another one the brother-in-law picked out, thanks so. And over here, last but not least, we got this super cool Doughboy Mushroom. Thanks, Rich. Appreciate it, buddy. All right, guys, as always, I hope you enjoyed this update. Hope you enjoyed the store tool of Shoreline Corals. Be sure to check out their Instagram and their website for some amazing eye candy and some wicked corals. All right, guys, don't forget to hit that like button. I'll see you guys on the next video.